Hello everyone, welcome to D4 Drupal channel. Today we are going to see about how to override a template which is coming from your core or your base theme. Okay, so first what you have to do, first you have to go to your uh, page and content. So now I'm going to override a node template. Okay, so first you open your uh, node, any node. I'm opening here this article node. And when you inspect here, so you will be able to see there is a tag called article. So this is the uh, article tag, so which contain all your uh, node data. And this article is coming from Olivero theme node.html.fitfile dot dot file here. So I'm these are the uh, hook suggestion we are having for the file name. You can create any name. So when you select a file name to override, you have to uh, make sure you have selected the correct pig name. Okay. So here it is suggesting you node iPhone iPhone 51 iPhone iPhone full means. So it is taking this node ID. Okay, so when you want to over it for all the, this is, I, I think this is basic page. No, this is article. So when you, when you use this uh, file name, node iPhone iPhone 51 iPhone iPhone full, this will work only for this 51 node. It will not work for other node, which is in the article content. Type. So when you want to do the uh, alteration for all the article content, you should not select the first two one full represent the view mode which you for which view mode you want to override this particular html tweet and next two is that uh, for the article you can take full or article whatever and node iphone iphone full means this will override for all the content type so when you use node iphone iphone full it will work for a basic page and also article so whenever you are selecting the file name suggestion you make sure you are selecting the correct one so here you even you can use node.html.tweak that also will work. We'll do both here and show you how it is working. Okay. So this is my custom theme which I created. So in previous video, I have posted how to create a custom theme. So this is the uh, my info file, and here I am using Olivero theme. That's why uh, here you will be able to see the node HTML is coming from the Olivero theme. Okay. So in your uh, template. Here you have to create a new file called node.html.twig. So once you've created, you need a content for it, okay? So first, uh, next, what you have to do, go to your uh, website folder and then go core themes. In themes, I am using Olivero, so I'm opening it. And you have to go to template and it is coming from template content folder. So go to content folder and open that uh, node.html.tweak and you can copy paste the full content what it has, okay? So once you add it, you can, whatever alteration you want for this particular HTML, you can do. I'm just adding one p tag here, add it, sample text for testing, okay? So I'm closing the p tag. And then now I'm going to refresh here. Before that, I will show you how the content is displaying. So it is containing home link and then description content. Now clear the catchy. So now catchy cleared. And here you can see the text which you added in your tweak file, it is coming. So this is how you how to alter the uh, any tweak file which is coming already. So when you inspect now and when you see the node file, you can see this is coming from custom theme, uh, theme not from the core Olivero, okay? And you can use uh, node iPhone hyphen, hyphen full also when you re rename, you can use node iPhone hyphen, hyphen full. And then now again go there, clear the catchy. Now catchy is cleared. So when you see here, you can see the template file is taking from node iPhone iPhone full dot HTML dot tweak. So this is the article content and we are fetching the 
config file from our custom key. Okay, this is how you have to override your template with the file name. To enable the file name suggestion, I already posted a video to configure your development environment for debugging for theming development. So you can check out that video. I will add that in the description. And that's it about today's video. If you like the video, please share, like, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.